What's up, everybody? It's AJ with eTrader.com. Today we're going to be checking out the bull ring corner anchor. So this is going to be a tie down point for you to haul stuff in the bed of your truck. And it goes in the corners of your bed, not the top. So you can easily reach it from the outside. Let's check it out. Taking a look at the construction and how it works. It's going to have a plastic cap up top. we got the screw in the middle where you loosen that. So that's going to allow you to get more space in between there. So when you go to install it, the metal backing plate is what goes into the truck bed. So that's going to keep it in the hole you put it in there. So when you tighten this back down, it won't come back out. Now you have a catch here. So not only does you, do you have a tie down loop, but you can pull it completely out and it stays in place. You can see how that works on the inside there. And then it can always pop out. And when you don't need it, you just push it in and it goes flush if the screw was all the way in. We'll show you in the truck. Now this is an example of how to use it. We have our generator tied down in the back of our truck. We are using the corner anchor points here up top. Then there's the standard factory down low. So I was talking about earlier, these are easier to reach from the outside because they're up here at the top of the bed. I had to climb up in the bed to make the attachment here on the bottom side. Now these are specifically made for your truck bed. So the ones we're looking at today are specifically for a Ram 2009 to present. Now there is different versions for different truck beds. So if you want a Ford or GM or even a Toyota, there are other options on our website for those because the backing plate changes its shape and size. So that's when you make sure you get the right one for the right truck. With our anchor points here at the top of the bed, it's much easier for me to reach in, undo the ratchet strap, release that tension, then disconnect it. And when I'm done, I just hit it and it pops back into place. That way it's flush and it's not in the way like the tie down points on the bottom. Those are the factory ones. They're not going anywhere. So you can trip on them or they can just be in the way when you're loading up stuff. I like that you can push these in and they're out of sight, out of mind. Our anchor points are gonna come in a set of two. You can also buy them a set of four if you wanna put them towards the back of the bed as well. Boring also offers ones that go on the bed rails up top. You see there's one right here. Works the exact same way. You can pull it up, snaps into place, and then push it down out of the way when you're done with it. We're gonna install these on the stake pocket in bed cut out here. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna put this section in first, which is the easier part. Then we have this metal plate that's gotta go in there too. So you can kind of work in there. I'm gonna go one side, then the other to make sure it sits flush. So I'll try to explain to you because you're not gonna be able to see a whole lot, but as I push it in there and try and angle the metal plate in at the same time, it'll eventually go right in. Now you can cut this out a little bit more if you just need a little bit. We could cut this and make it wider so it would fit easier. That's an option you have as well. Now with me out of the way, you can see that the plate is inside the bed. So we'll come back with our screwdriver and tighten up the screw. Now, with that tightened down, it's in place and you can use it for whatever you need to tie down. Overall, I like these as an addition to your truck bed. More tie-down points definitely help with whatever you're hauling. So I'm not just stuck with pointing something towards the back because that's my only two tie-down points. I have the ones on the rails. we got two factories on the bottom and on the side. So I can push this generator up towards the front of the truck, tighten it down, know that it's gonna be steady. It's not going anywhere. And that just opens up a bunch of potential to haul whatever I want in the back of the truck and keep it strapped down. Well, I think that does it. Thanks for hanging out.